Hi Team A and preschool friends. Welcome to Music Time with Anna. I'm Anna. I hope that you are all doing well. And let's greet each other with our hello song. Time to find your hand. Where's your hand? We'll help our children put their hands up high. Ready? Hands up. Up, up, up. And then we'll wave hello to the beat. One, two, ready, go. Wave, wave, wave hello. Wave hello together. Wave, wave, wave hello. Wave hello together. Hello. Hello. I just got back from a trip to the Olympic Peninsula. It's so beautiful out there. And I got to stay in a cabin in the woods. And guess what I got to hear all day and all night? Frogs. Frogs croaking. Ribbit. Ribbit. The sign for frog is by making two fingers placing them sort of against your voice box under your chin, right on your throat, and then flicking your fingers twice. Frog. And a reminder again with sign language assistance, for children who are sight capable, you can model by showing them the sign. We can also explore signing on top of their hand so there's that sort of kinesthetic, tactile experience, frog. And finally, providing fine motor manipulation and helping them find two fingers. Let's do that right now, find two fingers, frog, frog. And definitely join me with vocalizations because croaking, silly sounds, Anything usually gets a great reaction from our kiddos. So what does a frog say? Ribbit. Ribbit. The contrast between silence and the sound is really key. Ribbit. And then I'll also invite you to place your child's hand on your voice box. So that, um, that kind of lump in your throat that moves when you swallow. If you didn't know where your voice box was, your larynx. Ribbit. Ribbit. <laughs> you might be getting some really neat reactions. Ribbit. The frog song comes from Japan. And the title of the song is the frog song. <laughs> Kairu no Uta. Kairu is frog. Kairu. And this is a Team A and preschool favorite. Um, so maybe, maybe they'll recognize this song. Towards the end or the last section of the music, there are some long notes and some short notes. All right, so what we'll do is help our children with their hands to kind of paint or draw the length of the notes. So before we introduce the song, let's just explore that a little bit. And you can just use your speaking voice to use the words long and short long again long long one more long good and then for short let's um, provide a tactile experience and we'll just very lightly and very articulately um, very articulated tap uh, the top of their hand for short short Short, 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 short. So in the song, we hear the frog croaking in Japanese because animals make different sounds in different languages. You'll hear 
Here comes the short. Gero, 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 gero. Gua, gua, gua. Okay, let's listen to it. I'll go ahead and sing with you, and we'll continue to just um, express the length of the notes we hear with our hands, with movement. You might even um, instinctively <laughs> do some rocking, as I'm already finding myself doing as well. But at the very least, just move your child's hand from side to side. One, two, ready, go. Kairu no uta ga kiko eti kuru yo. Here's long. Gua, 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 gua. Short. Gero, 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 gero. Gua, gua, gua. Throw in a frog sound at the end, a little croaking. Ribbit. Frog. Kairu. Ribbit. More. Let's do it again. More. Let's do the exact same thing. Okay, so here's our hand movement expressing the length of the notes. One, two, ready, go. Kairu no. your voice. Ribbit. I'll invite you to continue doing the same thing or maybe adding an instrument if you have something near you or something that that uh, you can turn into an instrument, something around the home. Um, but now I'm going to accompany us with a glockenspiel. I'm trying to get it in the frame. Let me scoot over a little bit. You um, may see this and think, hmm, isn't that called a xylophone? Well, technically speaking, xylophones are made of wood. And Lachenspiels um, look exactly the same, but they're made of metal. There's our starting note. So as I mentioned, continue with the expression of the hand or maybe an instrument, and I will accompany us. One, two, ready, go. Kairu no utaga Kiko eti kuru yo Gua, 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 gua We were also just accompanied by my uh, dryer buzzer, so <laughs> maybe that got in the video too, I'm not sure. <laughs> Let's try again, one more time, just like that, with the sound of the xylophone. It's a really pure sound, so uh, this just really uh, reinforces the pitches that your child is hearing. And of course, take breaks. Um, and modify any way that you need to kind of follow their lead through this. Here we go again. One, two, ready, go. Kairu no utaga kiko eti kuru yo gua gua. Rest. And what 
does the Cairo say? What does the frog say? Wah. We can throw in that, that Japanese word now for ribbit. Wah. Wah. Don't forget, um, if you'd like your child to explore vibration, since that's what our voices do, <laughs> um, placing their hand on your voice box can feel really neat. And that doesn't just go for this song, but anytime you're singing with your child or just exploring your voices together. Ooh. Ribbit. Ribbit. The frog song, Kairu no Uta. Yay! I'm also um, including a YouTube link to a beautiful Hawaiian song called the Toad Song. <laughs> and the introduction is um, some actual frog sounds, frog and toad sounds. So um, that would be a great time to sign frog while your child is listening to that sound, um, to vocalize along with the sounds, and then um, I hope you enjoy it. All right. We're all done for today, so let's get ready to wave bye-bye. Find your hand. Where's your hand? Let's put our hand up, 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 up. And I will tap to the beat so we can wave together. One, two, ready, go. Wave, wave, wave goodbye. Wave goodbye together. Wave, wave, wave goodbye, wave goodbye together. Goodbye. Bye. Take care. I can't wait to see you next time.